The government's decision to reinstate taxes and duties on imported poultry has sparked controversy in Egypt. It's not just a competition aspect. Because the decision is backdated to November, it affects shipments stuck at the country's ports. Egyptians tend to prefer local poultry, and farmers in the country supply 90% of the market. I wasn't concerned about the exemption of import products because all my customers prefer live or fresh poultry. If it stays in the fridge for just one day, they won't eat it. That's why frozen chicken is the least popular. Because of the demand, local poultry used to be more expensive than some imported products. However, with the devaluation of the Egyptian pound, that has changed. According to the union, local poultry costs 25 to 26 pounds per kilogram. Without customs and with the devaluation of the Egyptian pound, what we now import costs around 31 or 32 pounds. With a six pound difference, why do you think anyone who could find a cheaper option would choose ours? Even with imports, the Egyptian market still can't meet demand. Shiha argues that the uproar among local producers can be traced back to those who monopolize the market. There are many poultry producers in Egypt, and many of them are small or medium-sized businesses. And then there are the tycoons who control the market, about 10 people in the entire country. They control the prices and they don't want any competition, so they are free to increase the prices as much as they want to. The prices are increasing, feed is costly. Chicks are more expensive. I used to pay two pounds for a kilogram, now I pay five. Some industry analysts are pleased the duties have been reinstated. I have a lot of studies regarding the capabilities of Egypt to enhance the uh, poultry industry, uh, in, in which we have uh, more than 45 billion Egyptian pound invested, uh, uh, opening opportunities of jobs. There is a lot of potentiality. I believe that Egypt can turn from, uh, you know, uh, uh, import substitution, supplying the uh, internal market or the local market to uh, the potential for exportation. Too. The government may have thought that reversing the duty decision would tone down the criticism. In fact, it had the opposite effect. Now questions are being raised about the few importers who've benefited from these few days of exemption. And local producers are calling for an investigation into the matter. Adel Mahroui, CCTV, Cairo.